Hello, welcome to this week's video announcements. I'm going to jump right in with uh, what's happening tonight. Tonight, Monday, December 10th, is our monthly drop-in grief group. Uh, that's led by Karen Campbell and happens in, in our Campbell Chapel. Um, again, that's 7 o'clock tonight, and it's for anyone who's experiencing grief of any kind. Karen would be happy to have you there. Tomorrow, Tuesday, December 11th, uh, 6.30 p.m. in the Campbell Chapel is our book discussion group, um, and it's going to be a series on Honest, Direct, Respectful, which is this book right here, Three Simple Words That Will Change Your Life. Um, and so if you want to discuss this book, it's about communication. It looks really wonderful. I've heard great things about it. Uh, come on out tomorrow night, 6.30 p.m. in the Campbell Chapel. This Saturday is our holiday gathering. Um, I'm so excited about this. So this Saturday, December 15th, starting at 4 o'clock, um, we are going to be uh, having a carol sing. Then we're going to pack bags for our community dinner guests so they can get special care packages at the community dinner the next day. Um, and then we're going to enjoy a shared meal. We're going to have a potluck. Um, so please, please join us 4 to 7 p.m. this Saturday here at the church. Uh, we'll be singing carols, we'll be packing bags for community dinner, and we'll be um, eating together, uh, which is always fun. Uh, I hope I will see you there. We are still looking for a few donations for the community dinner care packages that we're going to be packing um, on Saturday. So uh, if you are able to donate a few items, that would be great. I'm going to put a sign up genius in the comments, which uh, will let you know what items we're still looking for. Thank you to everyone who has already donated that filled. A lot of it filled up really quickly. We just have a few spots left, um, so I will put that that link in the comments and if you're gonna donate we just we need them by 4 p.m. on um, on Saturday so if you're coming on Saturday you can bring your donations then or you can drop them off at the church um, sometime this week when the office is open uh, the other donation that we've got going on right now is for our youth group holiday sale um, and that is happening this Sunday, so you have to get your stuff in before Sunday. So again, you can drop stuff off when the office is open this week. Um, and our youth holiday sale um, is going to happen at 11.30 this Sunday for adults, and before that for kids. So kids get to shop during faith formation classes. Adults can go up after the service. Um, and you can bring any gently used items to donate, and then um, you can come and peruse other people's gently used items to purchase this Sunday. There's going to be a 50-cent table, a $1 table, a $5 table, so you can get some really affordable holiday gifts there. Um, and the proceeds of the sale are going to be split between our monthly outreach recipient, Southern New Hampshire uh, Services Fuel Assistance, and a youth ministry trip planned for March 1st through 3rd. Uh, so it all goes to a great cause. So our youth holiday sale is just one of many things that are happening this Sunday. Uh, we, of course, at 10 a.m. we have our regular service and faith formation classes. Um, I'm going to be doing a sermon called The Mystery Is We Are Connected, and that phrase should sound familiar to you. Um, I'm looking forward to talking about the mystery of how we are connected to one another. Um, after the service, uh, the youth holiday sale will be going on. Um, our young adults are also meeting, so if you are between ages 18 and 35 and want to join our young adults for their regular meeting this Sunday, um, that's at 1130 in room 6. There is going to be a general assembly report back uh, 1130 in the fellowship room this Sunday. Uh, and that'll be for the 2018 General Assembly delegates will be available to meet with members of the congregation who are interested in an informal conversation about the themes and actions that emerged from that event. Um, there, You can also look on the UUA's website if you want to find out more about General Assembly proceedings. 
Um, and the, the GA delegates from last year are also interested to hear what aspects of attending GA you are most curious about to better plan for future Congress conversations such as this one. So please join them this Sunday. This Sunday is also the first practice for our Christmas Eve Choir. Um, our Christmas Eve Choir is, of course, going to be singing at, on Christmas Eve at both the 5 p.m. and 7 p.m. services. Everyone is invited to participate in the choir, and you can sing at just one or both services. They're going to be singing the same songs at both services, so you can decide. Rehearsals are going to be in the Campbell Chapel this Sunday, December 16th next Sunday, December 23rd, and then Wednesday, December 19th at 7.30 p.m. Both of the Sunday, Sunday rehearsals are at 11.30 a.m. right after the church service. Uh, please attend as many rehearsals as your schedule will allow. And if you need more information, you can always stop by the music office um, after Sunday services and talk to Jerry Davidson. She'll be glad to ha answer any of your questions. And the final thing that's happening this Sunday, I told you it was a busy Sunday, is our community dinner. So we'll be serving dinner for folks in the community who need a meal. Um, and everyone is welcome to volunteer. Um, there are a few volunteer slots still open, so I'll put the link in the comments where you can sign up if you want to volunteer at our community dinner. It's a great way to serve the community and um, also to uh, get to volunteer with some of the great folks from this congregation. It is December and Christmas is approaching and so are our Christmas Eve candlelight services. Um, these are one of my favorite or two of my favorite services of the year. I'm really looking forward to them. Um, so on Christmas Eve at 5 p.m. we're going to have a family oriented service um, and we'll uh, we'll light candles at the end of that, um, and at 7 p.m. we're going to have a um, contemporary lessons and carols service, and we'll light candles at the end of that service as well. Um, I hope you will join us for one of our Christmas Eve services, definitely a highlight of our year. There's um, some wonderful folks from our congregation who have adopted a little free library, and um, are taking care of it and they welcome your donations of adult Goodreads youth and children's books. The book donation area is in the coat closet next to Molly's office. Um, additionally, the Park Social Little Free Library could use a few more stewards, a few more caretakers. So if you are interested in this program, which provides books to the local community, take a look at the Sign Up Genius link that I will put in the comments um, and you can, um, you can sign up for that. You can also take a look at who's signed up there and talk to any of those folks if you're wondering what it's like to be a little free library caretaker. Um, and finally, Mount Cardigan Lodge Winter Weekend is going to be Friday, March 1st through Sunday, March 3rd, 2019. It's a great end of winter fun trip, uh, time to hang out with your UU friends, as well as go skiing, snowshoeing, sledding, hiking, or just relaxing by the fireplace. All the details for that are on our website. I will put the link in the comments. That's all I've got for this week. If you have any announcements you want me to include next Monday, make sure to send me an email by Monday morning and I will be sure to include it. Um, in the meantime, I hope you have a wonderful week, and I hope that I will see you this Saturday um, at our holiday gathering for carol singing, bag packing, and potlucking. See you then.